Hey everyone, it's Thackard, and welcome back to more Horizon, Horizon, Horizon Zero Dawn. Now, uh, we are picking up right where we left off last time. No moving forward. Immediately right back into it. We just talked to Silas, Cyrus, something or other. And uh, we got a, lot, a little more back round information on where we're headed we're going to like u.s robotics command which i'm assuming is oh no it's over here oh i was thinking it was this it's something different altogether interesting that being said we're missing two metal flowers i think it said Corrupted zones, bandit camps, into the frozen wilds, cause for concern, farewell. Uh, we'll do this really quick. It's not too far away. It's 666 meters away. Mm. Oh, collectibles. Yeah, we're missing two metal flowers. I wonder if those are where those are at. All right, can we see them? It looks like they're in an earlier section, so maybe this is, maybe they're in this area up here somewhere. Anywho, I'll find them at some point. Hang on, it's like I can filter? What if we turn... Yeah, turn it all up except for... I guess it would be collectibles? Huh. Not seeing any. Okay, well, I guess that's... Okay, so this guy is where? Down here. Uh, we can fast travel. Go and talk to him. Alright. So yeah, last episode, oh my goodness. Lore-wise, it was amazing. It was just like, continuous lore. We learned about the Deathbringers, which were the, like, Karja? Not Karja. Uh, where are the name of the Deathbringers again? They were the... We saw a little thing on them. But the Horus are the big metal devils that are like crashed upon the mountainsides. Um, the scarabs are the the corruptors. The kopesh, the kopesh are were the Deathbringers. So yeah, last episode was complete exploration and reading of lore and listening to lore. There was zero combat last time. It was actually pretty chill. A lot of climbing and doing such of that type but uh you know what Nell this is the crazy man who is killing bandits it's so bittersweet like a smile mm. for the bloody teeth what's the matter you look disappointed it's over <sighs> oh the bandit clans are gone 
I hear another turned back at the Southern Plains. Just at a sniff of the legend we carved. That's what all this bloodshed was for. To end the bandit threat. But what do I do for fun now? Kill. Unless... No, no. I guess this is our last farewell. After all we've been through, this isn't the place for that. There's a mesa south of Meridian with a view of the spear shafts. Meet me there. Okay. So we're... I mean, we might as well do that, right? Quest, side quest. Cause for concern, farewell. Is where... Way down here? I mean, okay. We have 15 fast travel packs, so we might as well use them, right? <laughs> Alright. No. He either wants to have a fight to the death, or he's gonna, like, toss himself off the top of the mesa. Because... I don't... I can't kill bad guys anymore. Oh, I remember being up here. Was this your doing, Nil? Did you murder everyone here? Save these for the trail. Actually, I think I was the one that might have murdered them. Just saying. By a satellite dish of some sort. No. I did wonder on my way here. Mm -hmm. Well, if you were luring me into an ambush. Where's the fun in that? Some bandit sprawl would never have done for our arena. But this, much better. There's a sense of drama. So, what do you say? How about we try to kill each other? Uh, why? Wait, you brought me out here to ask if I want to fight you? To the death. We'll savor it because we only get this one time. Actually, I don't know what else I expected. Uh, I don't need to kill him. I'm, uh, flattered that you think of me this way, but I don't want to kill you. Don't be hasty. When it's life against death, hunter against hunter, I know it'll come to you. Is that really what you want, Nil? You know, I don't think you have a death wish, but you have might be worse but I see there might be a need for you in this world I don't understand I won't fight you that's my decision you can respect it or try to shoot me in the back as I go then it's over your last arrow was the cruelest okay so I could have had a a fight with them my thought is in the future, we might need a slightly mad man who uh, goes around and murders things. I'll find a use for you. Maybe we can point him at the direction of, you know, uh, the Eclipse or the Machines. Okay, what other things we got? I have some skill points. Uh, what do we want to use them in? Double shot, maybe? Mount repair? Tinker. I guess we'll go with that. Alright. So, yeah, the next quest we have is just more main quests outside of the Frozen Wild stuff. 
I think I'll keep Frozen Wilds until we're all done with stuff. Oh, we have a tutorial for a Terror Blaster? Remove machine components with the Terror Blaster. Okay. Let's do this really quick. Uh, there'll be stuff down here. I think there was a way to jump down off of one of these sides if I remember correctly. Might have been over here by the uh, campsite. Yep, there it is. Alright, so let's equip the Terror Blaster, which I think is a little staff weapon. This guy, yeah. Alright. Let's find some targets really quick. And it's remove, what, 15 components? Stocking up. I didn't even notice that I had a mission up for this and hadn't done it. Stop dancing up. All right, what's over here? This thing is no joke. I uh okay. I I didn't I obviously was underestimating this thing's awesomeness. Holy cow. I was definitely, uh, underestimating this thing's, uh, damage potential. This will do nicely. I mean, those were long legs that were just blowing off the, its freaking feet. Okay. So, yeah, uh, I was thinking it was just kind of similar to the arrows, which it is, but it is quite... Powerful, actually. Okay. Well, I'm glad I did that uh, tutorial. I mean, if not just for completionist's sake, but uh, yeah, that that was okay. Not that wasn't too shabby. All right, quest. Nothing else. Map. Let's fast travel up to... I think I'm going to fast travel here first. That way I can... Oh, I, I can do it right here. Um, I want to... Uh, 
go to the vendor and make sure I'm all filled with items. Just in case I have to fight some stuff. Because that one other place, which I thought we were going to, that was in those like middle mountain sections, I fought a lot of stuff going up there. You know, it was a couple episodes back, including a freaking Stormbird. So, if that is what's going to be coming up, I want to make sure that I am fully equipped to deal with such things. I wonder if this guy has, uh, like, skins. No, he doesn't. Okay. Uh, we are at full capacity, so we'll want to free up some stuff. I'm thinking I can sell some of these. I haven't had anything that's needed bones in quite a while. I need two fish skins. But that's all that I've seen recently. Okay, that gives us quite a bit of empty space. Now let's buy some ammo. I'll, I'll buy this even though I don't use the damn things. Alright. Uh, what is this? Light tie downs, precision arrows, fire bombs. Really, that's all this guy has? Alright, so he doesn't have that much, actually. Alright. Slightly unfortunate. Just like falling off a mountain, slightly unfortunate. Um, I think I want to get some more stuff off of these guys, so. That's what I want. Did that not actually set him to burning? Okay. I wanted to explode explode them. I guess we can unlock him or we can uh, override him instead. Have them fight each other to the death. I guess the blaze canisters on these guys are like covered. Go get him. Hey, you're gonna do something to this guy or what?
I want the blaze canisters off these guys. All of a sudden, they're flashing! <laughs> Exclamation point, it's like, uh, incoming! Alright. Alright, so we got some blaze off those guys. Wind Hawks. This way. Okay. All right. I was following the wrong thing. I'm assuming it's going to be a charger. Yep. I like chargers. Lance horns. And something scanning for me. Part of me, guys, coming through. I discovered a campfire, it said? Alright. Scrapper. No, 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 I, I, I actually wanted that. I wanted those goods. I wanted those goods. Alright. Let's get to this next yep, save point. Charger site. Can I just cut through the woods? There's a vendor right ahead. Oh, yeah, that is another little Horus thing. We've been up here before. If they're not going to mess with me, I'm not going to mess with them right now. We got... I'm not showing that your focus is in the location. Shouldn't be anything you can't handle on your own. Carry on. Carry on. On my own, all right. All right, so I see a corrupted watcher. A couple cultists.
No corruptors themselves. Come on over here. Come take a look. See what that noise was. It's surely not just a person hiding in the tall grass wanting to murder you. What was that? Haven't you got anything better to do? Wait, what was that? Wait, what was that? What? Hey, how the hell did he see me? Alright, that was slightly unfortunate. So they were working on a corruptor, but it, it's not online. All right, good. Corruptors are interesting fights. Scarabs, as they were originally called. The grave heart and the shadow of a metal devil. A horse. So this was a horse. This is where they could get, they could take organic matter and turn it into Beasties. All right. All right, down we go. Ouch. You have to calm yourself. Oh, shit. <sighs> They're inside, too. Does it? Time to take a look around the room. <laughs> Operation Enduring oh. Victory. Explosions. What did that mean? Whatever it was, it doesn't seem to have turned out very well. Yeah. Trying tanks. Looks like quite an enduring victory we put our foot in today. Contact in 30 seconds. Hey, I think that's enough time for Sobek to finish Zero Dawn. <laughs> If this is really it, I gotta say, it's been an honor to serve beside these tanks. <laughs> Here it comes. Brace for contact! A battle. Frozen in ice and time. Uh, a battle that did not go well for them, it sounds like. I got you. Titan is through the defenses. Still on approach. Ah, crap. A live one. And it's pissed. We've got no mobility in here. It'll punch right through us. We hold the hedge at all costs. Then push back out. Are you getting this, Silence? Silence? Must be shielded. Which would make sense for this. I mean, it looks like a bunker. Have it shielded against the RF. Maybe the machines wouldn't be able to speak to each other in here.
I wonder if the horse killed them before it started to melt them into component parts. I sure hope so. Titan inbound, same play as Akron. Base defense locks it down. We engage, sever the limbs, blast out the fountains. Silence, you getting this? What is it? All oh, these soldiers. They died here. People die all the time. I'll keep going and find something interesting. Not like this. Alright, where are we going? All right, so she was KIA. I was expecting something off of it. Now it's just from a couple of uh, scarabs. All right. I'm not jumping on this, am okay. I am. First things first, always go backwards, right? It's a rule of video games, always go backwards first. That's where they put all the good loot. Hey, look. Up. Up. There you go. I'd have to ditch something. That wasn't something you could run? Yes, it was. Look at that. I can tell. It's yellow. Definitely awake now. Or not? It looks like I should be able to jump across to that piece up by the light there. Come on, up. That has to be some cold water, dude. There we go. Anything else up here? Mm. Oh, what was that? Alright, so that's just a lighting bug. That really freaked me out for a second, to be perfectly honest. Up, Aloy, up. Alright, here we go. So all I saw over there were some mushrooms. Must have been where the soldiers slept. Like the lodge in Mother's Heart, I guess. In a way. Log. Third Battle of California Marine. The swarm came in from the Pacific and... I don't know if it was the local Minutemen or the crazy 15th, but they'd set the garbage patch alight. Man, the sea was on fire. That stuff was... <sighs> the first wave of bots came in covered in burning sludge. They bought us an hour or two of slaughtering them on the beaches before the swarm recalculated. We pulled them inland, back to the Kalmar sprawl. Dropped buildings on them, EMP'd the grid. Huh. Standard operating procedure. 
The last time I was in California, I was five, six. The light was like that vintage social net filter that was everywhere in the 40s. All right, so they did EMP, use EMPs as like weapons against them. So it's not like there was a mass EMP, or maybe it's a super massive EMP. I don't know. Log. First battle of the Eastern Seaboard Wall. Had a long run up to it. This was before Kalmar, and projections were a lot worse for the East. For three weeks, we kept getting scrambled out to some coastal burb to train Minutemen. It was always raining on account of Europe already being torched. Block after block of prefab barracks. They were still printing barracks right up until the hour the main force hit. The Minutemen? We ran combat drills with them in the streets where they'd lived, trying to pretend they might live to die somewhere else if they paid attention. Nothing worse than the ones who actually bought into it. Hopeful, pestering us with questions about Zero Dawn, like we know something they don't. I swear, the more we do this, the more like the bots we are. Except they learn from every fight. And us? I'm not so sure. All right. What was this place? Bunker. Command bunker. Recalls, I've been instructed to remind you of Article 115 of base policy regarding unauthorized use of processor cycles. Specifically, 115C. Any holographic simulation not directly related to operational training or efficiency. Consider yourself reminded and enjoy your gaming. You know? They're like, the world's coming to an end, don't worry about it. Thanks for the mails, you. Time goes fast on active duty. Four months with the wreck and recalls, I don't know, 20 drops. In and out of the West Coast, fighting with these civilian enlistees, scrappy guys and gals. Their training is basically, here's a DEW, when you see a bot, hit it. <laughs> but somehow it's all coming together. Between us and the 6th MRB, we took down a horse at Lithium Beach. Pulled out before its buddies arrived, but to see a big one go down. I hope you made the news, honey. Showed everyone we're gonna have a shot at turning this around. We just need to give Project Zero Dawn the time it needs, and everything will be the way it used to be. So, I don't know. I don't know. Now, if I guess if they could kill all the horses, then they would have been okay. I know it's been days, honey. I'm so sorry. Deployments are getting real long and tougher every time. The swarm's getting better at predicting us. Less of us now. And we have to put in ten times the work for everyone gone. Like a family business on hard times, only... This isn't my family. It's not with you. I still try to see you. The life we had in the eyes of the people out there. I remember when they were glad to see us. When they still had hope. It all seems to be slipping away. I don't even recognize the places we're defending. The only thing I know I'm still fighting for is... You. The Zero Dawn to turn this around? Or whatever the hell that is. The furnishings were metal. How'd they ever get comfortable? It was the metal world. I guess they were used to it. You know? I'm assuming down is the direction which we are going. Hmm. Just one bed. Maybe their war chief's room. Corporal Sarai. Last night we got talking about D-Day 55. 
I was a kid then, only a few years out of boot camp. General assembly in a drone hangar. Summer and the sky was bare, the heat was killer. They say U.S. human combat forces are being disbanded. All automated now. We're last cycle's tech. Out like the old net. A million more on basic in a century uh, in a century recession. Could be you'll help build the robots that took our, uh, your jobs, or if you know how to handle a power suit, you can find a place that still uses manual labor. Maybe in the OEZ or China, where you're not our problem. Low suicide risk, said in my discharge file. All right. Just checking. Whoa, okay, going a lot deeper than I thought we were going to. This water has to be super cold. This is like glacial runoff. Sam in the door. Yeah, okay. first I'm going to go this way. All right, fine, we'll examine the door. Probably gonna send us in this direction, so. Red light. Guess that means no power. These wires must run to the power source. All right. <coughs> no, Aloy. <sighs> You've run across a thousand of those branches and beams and stuff why all of a sudden have you decided to just fling yourself off the side of one and not go across I haven't seen one of these since I it must be some kind of code right. maybe i should try scanning objects in this area these wires must run to the power source hollow locks Down, up, left, right. So that's so down, up, up, down, left, right, up. Down, left, right. Three power lines, resources. That makes one. Oh. Okay, then. We are going down. Up, up, down, down. Up, up. Down, down. That's two. One more. Hey, y'all wanted to know how I remember the geotherm system reboot? Goes like this. The bird flies north in summer, east in spring, west in fall, and south in winter. Didn't expect to hear nature poetry from the lips of Mike the GT Tech now, did you? As usual, I defy expectations. Okay, Mike the GT Tech. He said north. I wasn't listening. North, west, and uh, north, east, west. Oh, so north, east, west, and south, was it? I should have been listening, but I couldn't. 
didn't overly care about Mike and his poetry. Alright, we now have a door. Open door. Tears being raised. Power cell. So. I wonder what it's for. Ancient armory. An ancient suit of armor lies in the visible but out of reach. Okay. Scrapper. A suit of power armor. What could I possibly use that for? Fire! I need one! Like, yeah, I'm going to think about it. Next. Level 50. Eclipse has as dumb AI as some of the robots did. They're leaving. They, they didn't learn very well either. Can't find any trace of them. <laughs> Can't find any trace of them. Second. I missed, jeez. All right, there we go. My turn. Yeah, but hang on. All right, we'll put that there. All this stuff to pick up. I'll be with you soon enough. Come here, little scrapper. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Gotta pick my shrooms.
more shrooms. I don't know why, but I guess it's just how they have it lit. It almost looked like it's a, uh... Need them soon enough. It almost looked like it was a library of some sort, but it's just how they had this place lit up, that's all. Up we go. That dude just chilling. Eh, I'm good. We got some ice ice mushrooms. That was that was the exploded man. Easier when I was a kid. You're still a kid. She acts like she's like really old. She she's not. She's a youngin. She's a youngin. Anything else around? Oh, <laughs> I saw I saw the light of my own focus. I was like, "Whoa, what is it?" Looks like you have, we have more and more. I think we'll take a break here, and we will pick up and do more of the gro uh, the grave horde after just a bit. So, catch you guys next time. If you enjoyed or disliked this video, I do hope you comment on it and give it a thumbs up or down. If you want to see new videos, please hit the subscribe button, and to be notified of new content when it comes out, hit the notification bell. But for now, thanks for watching. Have yourself a great day, and don't forget to bring it no matter what you do. And I will see you guys in the next video.